So. I'm gonna set you down here. So wait. I'm gonna open this. I am using a knife and I have a dog supervision. Plus I have experience in knives. Sam? I think that's good. Yeah. So here is the first thing. It is a face vacuum and a mint. We will go in the bathroom. And test it. I've been running this for years. We got fairy lights. Now this you can put inside or outside. Third thing we got this for thing. And felt or it looked cool. Okay, next up, we got this for my vanity. I'm really excited about this because I can never do makeup in my room and I never have a mirror to come out here and do it. So, final thing is this and I'm really excited. It's supposed to open. So, I'm going to take this box and this knife. Mm -hmm. Actually, I'm going to go in the bathroom and test this thing first, and I'm going to go in the door. Okay. So, into the bathroom. <laughs> so, this is a face vacuum. Um... I'm actually very, very outside. And, and then basically what it does is you basically vacuum your face. So, I am going to set you right there. So, it pretty but it will probably need batteries. Yes, we are definitely going to need some battery. So what you do is it basically comes with this head and then you get... Basically you have three different heads and then you put batteries in this, you turn it on. Yeah, I'm going to go put some batteries in this, and I will come back to you. So we got batteries in it, my dad. And we're going to test it with a different head, because I feel like I kind of want this one. So let me explain the purpose of this product before. So here's what it looks like. You have three different heads. Well, four. So you have this one that's on this one. This one. And this one. And pretty much the purpose of the front is it basically cleans out your face. It vacuums out your face. And for this, I'm also going to get one other thing real quick. <laughs> so I got lip gloss. You're right. It vacuumed out your pores and it's supposed to clean your but I got lip gloss to test if it does goopy stuff.
Okay, wait, we're gonna get a less precise pen. Can I feel it? Okay, this is really section and I kind of feel like, oh. Okay, I'm kind of scared. I'm like, here, we're going to try it, but we're going to try some the original head. And see where that goes because it's very, very suction and I kind of wish there were multiple settings. I love this and it's not quite getting it, but it's, well, it does make your favorite, but off camera I did check and that is totally normal for like a few minutes, so yeah. It's fun. Okay, so now I'm gonna turn it off. Oh, I feel, okay. There's definitely stuff by the spot that I don't get. So now we are gonna put some lip gloss. I don't need lip gloss. But we're going to put it, see if it does. That just got it off, like, no problem. So now I'm going to wipe the out. Because, because some of it did get on the outside. Okay, we're gonna wipe it and then we're gonna get the final spot. And then we are gonna get up here again because. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you here's what we got. Kinda gross. I like that this is gross, but it's also really, really fun, and I will be using it so much. So now you rinse it. So I'm going to set this here, and I'm going to go get the next product. This 10 out of 10 recommend is fun. At first I was kind of scared to be honest because I didn't realize the suction power but now I love it. Wait. Okay I'm sorry I gotta test it. There's this head and I want to see this head. I 
I'm wishing I had when I had my pimple because it basically helped with pimple and that sort of. Oh, I like this. It's not exceptionally, but definitely worth it. So we're going to do the next project. I'm going to do this one because I really want to do this. And there's tape. Luckily, I still have this guy's there. Now this is going to be bad, but it's an LED mirror in a cute heart shape. Why? Because I like a heart shape. So, okay, makes sense. Oh, it also is a jewelry holder. So, half kind of a symbol. I'm cool with that. So, we're going to put some batter. Yeah, I need you on battery duty. Mm -hmm. You have to put batteries in that. I like that this tray up already gets a bonus point because the tray part, you can also store jewelry. And it gave me bubble wrap. I like bubble wrap. Here. I'm gonna let him get batteries. So we got batteries. I'm gonna assemble it. This is I'm gonna show you the box first. Okay. So this is basically a heart-shaped mirror that is an LED light. Now I'm gonna show them first. Warning, this is bright. Love it. Okay. Love it. Okay, this. This, I feel like this, I'm not even going to really test it with makeup. I can already tell that I love this. 10 out of 10. So now, let's see what. We're going to save those two products for last because I feel like those are last. This one does not involve batteries. It just involves. So this one is based. The rest of these we're going to do in my bedroom. Because this one goes in my bedroom. So I'm going to take you back to the bedroom. So, I'm going to close my door. We're going down the floor. We're going to test these. We're going to do this. We're just going to rip it open. This is basically a vision board thing. I it's a message board. So you basically put a message on this and then then you hang it on your wall. So now I am gonna create a message. And you get all of these, which I'm very outside. Now I have to come up with a method. So I'm thinking. Hmm. I don't know what I wanted to say. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me find H. It's annoying because if you look at it like one minute, wait, here's H. Okay. Got A. And they just whisk right off. Or they pop. Why are you supposed Okay, so I'm gonna, 
I have scissors over here. Because I realized I was doing it wrong. Okay. So yeah. I need a I'm gonna come back to you. So that took some effort. I'm gonna put one more thing on it though because we're gonna put explanation we're gonna put like two explanation points. So, if I can get So I found a flaw with me that but I also really, really like it. I just don't like the flaw. Okay, you know what we're doing? Something else. Okay, I'm gonna get back. So let me put the hood back to kind of so there's a very big flaw about them that is kind of an issue which is the letters are really really hard to get off and so but here you go in a minute at the end of the video my dad is gonna hang it up but it says hard work pays off when, it, so it says hard work pays off XOXO to explanation points. So the flaw with this is that, so the letters come on like this thing, and you would think it would be simple like twist and maybe pull, oh, and they pop right off. No, they don't do that. Uh, I can barely get them with scissors. So that is a flaw, and especially if there's some like, like this one or some like, and they're close together, it's really, really hard. So I actually don't like the explanation points on here. Here, I'm gonna replace it with a fifteen. So we're uh, okay. So uh, 
So, I don't hate this product. I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. Because it comes with everything, and for the most part, it's good. But getting these letters off, like, you might need to do some work on. Because... Better yet, we're just going to leave it because hard work pays off. So now I'm going to take, wait, where did I set the echelonic? Also, these things are super, super tiny. Kind of an issue because, right, right now we have the issue of that. Wait, there they are. They are, so I'm going to set those right there. And the situation is that they're super tiny. That's kind of an issue. If one falls on the ground, you can't find it. Like, it's really, really hard to find. So, yeah, for the most part, eh. On to the next product, which is this. So, this is basically... Okay. Let me just open it first. Yeah. Um, okay. So it is smaller than what. I thought it would be here in this. Let me check because it does like a bunch of stuff. So, okay, we can do that to double it. What? What protect? There's no protected film, okay. For crazy. So it pretty much is okay. So I figured out. When I bought it on the website, it said that I like, guess the thing, but I think it was mistyped. Or so pretty much what it is is it's a marble waterfall thing that is built to. I got it because. First up, it makes cute room decor. Second up, so pretty much what you do is you cut some double A batteries, which we're about to get. Okay, that is kind of concerning. And then you put. Wait, I got. Okay, does it come? And then you put the rocks in there with some water and then you pretty much turn it on and then it's gonna you turn it on and then pretty much it much is a waterfall it's like a marble waterfall so I'm gonna go get I'm gonna check to see I'm gonna open the last product because we're gonna need my dad to come back here to help me with this. Now, here's the thing. I got kind of moved some stuff. So, yeah. Okay, so basically we're going to do these indoor. You can do them indoor or outdoor from what I'm getting. It comes with 
sticks. So yeah. But and also I thought this would need batteries, but it doesn't. It's like solar panel. So But it's fairy lights. Essentially, I was in between fairy lights or LED lights, but Five Below didn't have very good LED lights from the looks because it was only like three feet, like, packs, and that's not very good. So we are gonna, okay, so I, Check the instructions and the first step is to peel. There's like a sticker on this. So peel that off. And now I'm gonna go get my dad to get two double A batteries and and bring him back here so he can help set me up. And if you're wondering where we're setting him up, I am gonna pretty much I didn't really think this through. <laughs> okay, so we're going to move that stuff on my wall. Not that hard. Wait. And then we're going to figure some. Out. Okay. Peace. There's the LED light. Now, basically, we put batteries in. Okay. So, let me place it down. So, now, it says to pour the water in, but doesn't specify by how much. So I'm just keep adding and lifting it up. So I actually grab like the perfect amount of water and now you add it the rock. Basically, this is supposed to be a water fountain and it's supposed to have rocks. And it's like also like a sleep machine, but it does say like So, I'm gonna, so, um, let me, okay, I have to set you down.
So, Tana. Okay, so I love that. We're gonna set this right here. Also, the um fairy lights are really cool. But they're solar panels, so now I am gonna test this mirror. If I can. And so here's the mirror. Watch. So we're just going to do some makeup. We're gonna, we're gonna, and we're also going to the face vacuum again. So we're going to do uh, foundation, eyeshadow, and... Okay, so we're going to say that. Also, my face is kind of pink. That's because I didn't do um, the thing long, the face vacuum long, and so there's still some local. Here. So. I'm just going to dip, dip. Oh, yeah, we like this. Cute. I like this actually a lot. This. Now we're just going to. Oh, yeah, we want a little bit of blush. Let me grab my. Just gonna swipe, swipe, swipe. I'm gonna roll in it. Um, well, it's not good makeup, but we're gonna go with it since this is not about doing good makeup. This is about testing the mirror. Uh, then I'm gonna explain why I chose to get the mirror. I'm also only doing a little bit of makeup here. Why? Because basically, I don't like wasting makeup, and I am basically just wasting makeup. Yes. Uh oh. You got some blue. Uh. Oh. Like I purposely did that. I know it looks bad, but now we're gonna test. One. We're gonna add one more thing to the mix. Yeah, we're going to test this. Throw some purple. Okay, so now we love the mirror. I'm getting the mirror 10 out of 10 because it's a functioning mirror. Also, it did give me a surprise, which was when I bought it, I didn't realize the bottom is a jewelry holder. So now, we are going to switch heads because I don't like this head that um, you want kind of like, actually we're just going to put this head back. Okay, so I'm changing head. I this head is not like the most sectiony, so we are going back to this head. But first, I'm gonna clean the in. So. 
So I took a little eyeshadow brush and I basically put it I feel like it should be doing more, but I also feel like it's doing plenty. It's getting it, it's just not getting it very fast. Don't worry, Sam, I'm okay. So pretty much got most of my chin. So now we're going to test it on my cheek. Go oh, right here first. It has, okay. I'm gonna get all of this off and I'll update you. As you can tell, I'm still wearing makeup. It doesn't really, it will help you remove your makeup and I feel it will if you do it a very, very long time. So I'm gonna show you my face is disgusting. So hate this head. Try to, it's too much. Here's the thing, it basically gives it too much of a suction, and this head is like way too big, so I don't really like it. Now, we're gonna use the one that I tried this twice. So, a lot of it goes in here, and that's like, well, some of it, you can't tell, but there's some stuff. He also got like, but, okay, I'm going to show you this. Like, you can't see it, but in reality, there's quite a bit that you can kind of, there's quite a bit of stuff in it. It's definitely got its stuff. We're going to move on to the next. This, I feel like I'm going to try it without the, I feel like it's good. But the scarred piece, to make it like super precise, definitely collects a lot, but also at the same time, on that head was kind of cool. Here's the monstrosity. Yeah. You can't see it. you can't see it but monstrosity. Love the mirror. The mirror is helpful because I got it because I can't do makeup in here. The lighting is always too bad and I just also I don't have a mirror to travel with, so that is very helpful. Now I love this. I very much appreciate this. Okay, wait, so I put that on now. The fairy lights, I plan to put pictures on. We're gonna, I really wish I'd had some 
this one is probably my favorite now to clean it because it needs to be clean. I t a I sh okay. You're supposed to rinse it, but when there's not a thing to rinse it, with, I go in with a eyeshadow brush and I literally just kind of clean it up. Don't worry, I have a million eyeshadow brushes in. So out of everything, my least favorite, honestly, was that board behind there. You can see it. The reasoning is because it had a flaw that made it kind of a massive flaw, which is that the letters are way too small so they get lost super easy. But also with them, the issue is that they're really hard to cut off. I'm going to remove the makeup. Now, my, now, the item next to that, now, I have to say is the waterfall thing. I love the water thing, but on the website, up by below, it said it did multiple things, and it kind of, like, I mean, and I didn't really look into that, and it kind of only does, like, two things. Which is that, um, um, it looks cute, like some cute room decor, and it's also a waterfall, and I feel like it's good for night because it's a waterfall. Now, now, I do like, there were some bonuses with that that I wasn't at. I do like that there's enough rock to cover an entire, or like cover the part that the rock goes on. That night, and it is tinier than what I thought it would be, which I honestly like because I'm, I'm very picky with space. And so, like, I don't like things taking up a lot of space. And that's great, it's tiny, it's compact, but it's honestly, like, amazing. And the um, thing next to that would be the fairy lights, which I'm gonna go turn off. Because I can clip photos onto them. They're cute. And also a solar panel. So it's just taking natural light. So that's great. And, and then I feel like my second favorite thing is the mirror. Because this is going to be helpful. Oh, you can see yourself. But look how bright this light is. Like with two batteries. I like that this is adjustable. So I can have it down, I can have it up, like however I like it kind of up. It's heart shaped. And speaking of heart shape, I'm going to tell you. And um, today, and my dad went to Bojangles and got my lunch. lunch. I get the spicy chicken tenders, just the chicken tenders, but all we come with the biscuit. And today the biscuit was heart shaped, so that was kind of cute. Um, the face vacuum is my favorite. Also, I did like the heart-shaped like light or heart-shaped mirror. I like that it has a light on it because it's good to do make. Also, I don't have a mirror to travel, which is really annoying. Sometimes my dad will go to the store super early, and then I'll like want to do makeup, and then but I can't come back here and do makeup because. My mom can't be by herself. So, yeah. Because she had a stroke a few years. Okay, I'm testing this real quick on something. Okay, don't worry, I'm gonna clean this out in a minute. And I was testing it because I have this spot of like makeup or something. 
on my arm and it got rid of it. Like it's not, it still can kind of there, but I feel for the most part it got rid. Of. And my, I like that with the um mirror thing. It also the part you can store jewelry, which I like. I am gonna probably store like, but let's see. It's annoying because I just want to store something. There, the thing is that I have so much jewelry home, but not a lot of jewelry. And so I have like two different rings, some earrings, and a few things. But yeah, and it's annoying because sometimes I'm like, Ugh. I want to like, this is cute, and I feel like I love this. My favorite is the face hack. Because, okay, here's the thing, it doesn't, it will eventually re remove your makeup, you just gotta do it like a million times, cause, which is a flaw. But, on the bright side, it cleaned my face shockingly well, and I had so much disgustingness, and I wish I could show you, but the tablet's not picking it up. That I'm straight up mad. Because I'm now, it's showing me the fact that I never wash my face, which is on it, which my face never gets washed unless I'm wearing makeup. No, it kind of um, backfired, so now I know to wash my face. So yeah, I'm going to go clean the heads real quick, and then I am going to keep this in the bathroom. Peace.